So let's talk a minute about the side effects because we haven't really gotten into that. And in this, I'm going to tell you which are the agents that I go to when I'm trying. To, remember, we talked about the importance of avoiding side effects, and that's kind of what you, in terms of that decision making about well, which antidepressant would be best for this particular person. So we've talked about the akathisia, that too much coffee feeling. Generally, people don't, I mean, if you start slow, some people will tell you can get away without it being too much of a problem. But generally, if it's a problem, people are going to stop it. They're not, uh, you can't, like, say, just ignore it. Akathisia is horrible. So you either have to either decrease the dose and see if you can go slower or switch agents. Um, of the, anti, of the SSRIs, I find that generally um, acetylopram or Lexapro has a little bit less of the akathisia and certainly has less, um, this is my clinical experience, not based on data from some study, but my clinical experience is that the next side effect, sexual dysfunction, acetylopram seems to be a little less of a problem than do the other SSRIs. So um, that is a reason I will, will go with that. Um, <clears throat> other options for the akathisia, propranolol, benzodiazepines, if they're appropriate for the patient, um, do help with the akathisia. In fact, we will see akathisia later this afternoon when we get to dealing with um, antipsychotics. And we're gonna talk, because there you really need to keep treating, and it's a huge problem with that class of medicine.